A couple nights ago, I had a dream. It was kind of a nightmare uh, where I was working tech support in a hotel. I've done tech support before, but never worked in a hotel. I mean, it could have been I was doing room service. It was kind of unclear what exactly my job was, except that I would receive phone calls. There would be a ticket on my phone. I'd resolve the issue on the phone, and they'll be done. Except in this dream, uh, when my shift ended, and I was ready to go home, someone reopened the ticket. I'm like, I'm off duty, and my phone's triggered, and it's got this ticket on it. Someone else is handling it, but my phone is still locked to having this ticket. And I, just, I could hear the conversation, but um, my phone was locked. I couldn't close the app. I couldn't reboot the phone. Couldn't do anything. I kept getting an error message. The microphone was in use. Which, maybe I'm making too many videos lately that the microphone is in use. I don't know. I don't think I'm making enough videos. I need to make a video every day for a year. Anyway, at some point the issue was resolved. And then it was opened again. So I was stuck in this loop of having a phone that was a brick. I could not use it. So I was on tech support in my dream to try to resolve what was going on with my phone. Maybe I've got a phone addiction. You know what? We're not here to analyze the dream. And then I woke up. It's not unusual for me to remember my dreams and then later share about them on Facebook. Shoot, last night's dream was about a cafeteria worker who kept hiding my food. Um, if there's another channel, I could see these dreams animated or reenacted like a little skit not doing that this is a very bare bones experiment as you can see i still even have a cloth thingy hanging there eventually there will be knickknacks on that shelf hasn't happened yet but um uh, yeah wouldn't it be nice if we had the technology uh, i think uh, strange days kind of did something like this where while you're sleeping, your dreams are recorded. <clears throat> and then I guess you could have a job where you're just uh, editing and reviewing these dreams. So it makes YouTube videos a lot easier. But I can't imagine that you'd be editing your own dreams. Otherwise, your dreams would be about editing dreams. And that would be kind of recursively silly. Um, so what are your thoughts on possibly monetizing, like YouTubers monetizing sleep? There should be like a sci-fi story about this. I don't know of any. But uh, should this be something that happens or is like sleep the last bastion of safety against capitalism?